out now for a month now an IIT professor Dr. Agarwal has been on a hunger strike against a plan to build dams on the Ganga. This is not the first time he's been on this hunger strike. Earlier he forced the Uttarakhand, Uttarakhand government to scrap two dam projects. He claims that these projects, this damming of the Ganga will destroy the mighty river. 37 days ago, Professor G.D. Agarwal pledged a fast unto death in the capital. He is protesting plans to dam the Ganga in Uttarakhand, a move that he says would divert so much water into tunnels that 60 kilometers of the river will be left just with a trickle. 76-year-old Agarwal, who has headed IIT Kanpur's civil and environmental engineering departments, has with him his colleagues and students. A very large proportion of IIT alumni who are concerned as Indians, not only as IIT alumni, but we are concerned for something which is sacred to this country, to this society and civilization. And we believe that nothing should be done which jeopardizes this. Agarwal's mobilization last year made the BJP government in Uttarakhand scrap two state hydroelectric projects in the upper reaches of the river. Now, as the National Thermal Park Corporation starts building a series of dams, the protest has grown stronger and wider. We have a website, www.holyganga.com. We welcome all people, anybody can join uh, who is concerned about the Ganga, and we would welcome everybody to join us in this effort. On Tuesday, the Prime Minister declared the Ganga a national river and launched the Ganga River Basin Authority to manage its waters and save it from environmental damage. Looks like Professor Agarwal, on paper, has a supporter in the country's most powerful man. Only if their vision meets on the ground. In New Delhi with Siddharth Pandey, Akash Das Gupta for NDTV.